taking Friday's game and pushing it forward with this one. What's kind of the biggest motivation coming off of that one? Um, just to get better. We know we didn't play to our full potential at UTSA, so we just came back the next day and practiced hard, got our extra shots up, and just stick to the game plan because we know we're not, we're not going to shoot like that every night. So just get better every game, really, learn from mistakes. I think, you know, we just had to come together. Uh, game, we didn't play our best games in either one of those games, but we yeah, just keep fighting. Uh, Nigel, you, this is one of your best performances since Hawaii. You know, coming back from coach kind of attributed uh, Corpus Christi, you know, as your birthday, kind of putting pressure on yourself a little bit. But uh, do you guys take it that way, or what was different tonight for you? Uh, I think when I uh, came back from Hawaii, I kind of got the big hit. And uh, I just had to sit back, calm down, you know, play basketball. Right. And for someone like you, what's it like having a, a second guy like this to go to? You know, it's, it's it's a blessing. It helps our offense a lot. It helps. He's a great defender. He's he's he can do it all, a little bit of everything. So it just helps to have him on our team. Nigel, uh, it seemed like you you didn't you weren't just scoring and getting rebounds, but you also were dishing that quite a bit. You had seven seven assists, so basically you were three assists from a triple double. What uh what led to you seeing everything that wide open? Uh, I really don't know. I mean, I was just having fun. Trying to play basketball and have fun. And I didn't know I had no one near seven assists. Wow. Uh, the defensive intensity really kicked up in the first. Uh, Gasper said it kind of tailed off in the second half, but uh, you guys came out. Were you guys looking to prove, kind of prove a point that Friday was not the team that you guys are? I mean, yeah, of course. We knew that uh, Friday that was, that's not our team. And Coach was emphasizing getting the lanes to play our defense like we played in the last years. and and, you know, just play how you usually play. So we came out tonight and we showed. And to talk about the ball movement a little bit, you guys are constantly zipping it in and around. Does it feel different from, I know you guys moved to a certain motion offense last year, but this one's kind of adjusted a little bit. Does it, especially for you as someone, uh, someone who's been in the system, what's it feel like this year? Um, definitely feels more comfortable for me, myself. Um, it just, we had to sit back and see what was wrong with our, our offense. So. It was just ball movement and getting people open, really, was our main thing, and spacing the floor out. So we have, like, Nigel or OJ can drive. Then you have, like, me and Bobby can catch a shoot all day. So it's just learning our game and where we get our shots from, really learning the offense, buying in. What do you feel like you still have to, still have to step up on? I just got I, consistency, mainly. You know, if I could do this every night, I think we'd be a pretty good team. So, yeah, I just got to be consistent. And not even this, just... I mean, 23 points, that's, that don't, I mean, I might not ever do that again, but I got to continue to rebound the ball, continue to guard on the ball. I think that'll make us the best team we can be.